Good day, guys. Thanks for visiting Richard's Corner. My name is Richard, and today we've got a nice little haul for my friends over at the Value Village here in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Now, if it's your first time visiting Richard's Corner, the idea of my channel is thrifty collecting, trying to show you how you can find your favorite toys, books, video games, and movies at far below retail by saving and shopping the thrifty way. So today's haul again is from Value Village here in Winnipeg, Manitoba. The bag is already split open, so you can already see the, the Mario Brothers uh, Princess Peach McDonald's toy there. But I've also got some awesome Snoopy toys. I've got another Mario toy there. I've got a Peter Rabbit toy. So it's basically a Happy Meal haul, uh, mostly. Although this K2SO cup topper thing is actually very much my chase for this particular package for a whole $2.99. So I think I did uh, fairly well, and I'm really looking forward to sharing this haul with you guys. But I do want to apologize to all my viewers um, that I haven't posted since Thursday. It's just been kind of a busy week. I know life happens to all of us YouTubers, so uh, I'm glad to be here today, Sunday the 8th, and I'm hoping that you guys will enjoy this haul. Before I show you the stuff on the tabletop too, I do want to welcome two new subscribers that came on, uh, GoToGeeks and um, Jman63. Uh, these two guys just joined my channel today. Welcome guys I hope you guys enjoy your stay and I hope that some other subscribers come uh, following suit after you like a few videos so thank you guys for joining the Richards Corner team so again it is Richard from Richards Corner here let's take a look at uh, some online pricing for all these items and show you uh, how far ahead I got today so as you can see we have everything laid out here now I've got one two three four five six seven keepers and I as I mentioned at the start of the video uh, I paid a whole $2.99 for this before any discount or taxes uh, there is a discount program at Value Village if you donate enough you get a 30% off discount I think I might have for this particular haul but I'm counting it as a $2.99 haul today and divided by seven it works out to be only 43 cents per keeper and I'm keeping everything from this haul which I'm very fortunate for and uh, when I show you some of the online pricing for some of the active of, um, eBay listings that I have um, I've, I've, I've found anyway for each of these items you'll see that I got a way ahead for these and I'm really really super pleased uh, I'm going to start uh, right from the front and work my way back and the K2SO is probably my chase figure for this so I'm going to uh, talk about each of these briefly so you guys get a, a sense of uh, why I'm so excited about some of these ones okay so I'm gonna start with this nice little Peter Rabbit marble game now this one was released back uh, well, actually just this year 2018 and it is a Peter Rabbit marble game that resembles Hungry Hungry Hippos. Basically, you just have to make him go forward and he'll jump on uh, any of the... Um uh, marbles as they as they go along now the downside of this is that um, they do get stuck in the corners <laughs> so they're not really it's not like the best marble game for it but the general concept of it is fairly clever it's a really cool design I love the colors love the uh, the, the Peter Rabbit characters inside uh, really really nice it's a really uh, endearing toy uh, I love I love these kinds of McDonald's toys because they are interactive versus just being display although I will display it as um, part of my Happy Meal collection I'm really, really uh, pleased to find it anyway. It does work fairly well. I think the brown one is a little bit more sticky than the other, than the actual uh, Peter Rabbit one, but uh, it, it still works fairly well. So a really, really nice 2018 marble game from the Peter Rabbit McDonald's Happy Meals right there. So continuing on with the haul here, we have a 2017 uh, Super Mario McDonald's Happy Meal toy. This is obviously Yoshi. Really, really love the wonderful green and white color scheme here with the red uh, shell-like back that sticks out his tongue. That's the only articulation on this. Love the little orange contrasting boots and his little um, spine, which is really, really cute. This is just an adorable figure. Uh, I really love the way this McDonald's line of uh, toys came out. Uh, very, very, this this particular character anyway, just really, really awesome uh, mold for him and just a really wonderful detail and expression. <laughs> so that's a really nice 2017 Yoshi. And then from the same line, this is a 2017 Princess Peach, again from the Mario um, uh, McDonald's Happy Meal line. Uh, when the wheel underneath the base turns, she turns as well. So I think I've hauled both of these before, but they are wonderful extra additions to my collection, although I probably don't need to keep two of them. So I'm probably going to put uh, one up in the uh, overflow marketplace in the very near future here. So Really nice uh, figure though. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust my light so that I don't blow this up. But look at that. That is a really nice Princess Peach figure here. Again, from 2017, the McDonald's Happy Meal line for Super Mario Brothers. That is Princess Peach as well as Yoshi in the back here. 
So this is a 2017 uh, toy as well from Despicable Me 3. This is Pumping Iron Minion. <laughs> and this sort of speaks to me because as, as a fit geek, I do work out uh, as often as I can. And uh, this is just really speaks to me that he's pumping iron, literally. <laughs> There's a little lever on the back that um, shows him pumping iron. I've, I've hauled one of these before, but it's still worth uh, showing off and mentioning that this is just such an awesome little figure. I love his jailbird outfit here and that he's still pumping iron staying fit until he um, until Gru sets him free along with his other minions <laughs> so again it is 2017 pumping iron minion from the mcdonald's happy meal toys uh, that promoted despicable me 3 not a bad find right there now one of my most lovable characters from the Peanuts series is Snoopy and I've got two of them here. I've got a helicopter Snoopy and I've got um, Beagle Scout. <laughs> uh, and this one I'm, I'm really really happy to find but I'm so disappointed that his light is already out like it doesn't light up anymore and that and I and if you know me and uh, my past hauls uh, whenever I see older um, Happy Meal toys that have a little light on it when it still lights up it's such a <laughs> such a satisfying thing but I love that like Woodstock is hanging out on his hat here I love that he's got a little green backpack and matching flashlight um, this does have security screws so you can see the triangle head um, screws in there I do have a security set of um, screwdriver bits so I'm gonna actually try to replace the battery and redeem uh, re rejuvenate the flashlight so that it works again but this is uh, from 2018 the uh, Snoopy uh, has come out with um, sorry McDonald's did come out with a bunch of Snoopy toys very recently so this is from this year McDonald's Happy Meal Snoopy toys that's Beagle Scout uh, Snoopy and then over here we also have helicopter uh, Snoopy which is really cute um, there's no um, action on him other than just sort of being able to twirl his his ears in that comical helicopter style fashion uh, he does do this in in the comic strips as well as in the animated cartoon so that's really cute that they captured that in one of his toys um, this doesn't have um, oh wait a minute oh <laughs> Look, I didn't even notice that. There's a stamp here on the bottom. That's really cute. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. So um, there's a, a compartment on the bottom here that you can actually put the stamp on here. I'm just trying to put it back on now. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. So uh, so a nice little helicopter, or um, yeah, helicopter Snoopy from McDonald's again from 2018 this year uh, from the Happy Meal Toys uh, promoting Snoopy. Really cute. <laughs> Now, the chase figure for me is this awesome K2SO cup topper. Now, I call it a cup topper because this plastic base actually goes on top of a souvenir cup that you get in movie theaters. For This was for Rogue One, uh, the... Um, sort of a, another Star Wars movie before uh, A New Hope but um, that exists in the in the Star Wars um, universe but it isn't in itself it's sort of it, in itself it's by itself a, an independent movie so it's really cool uh, K2SO is an Imperial robot that was reprogrammed for the Rebellion and he actually sacrifices himself to uh, save uh, uh, Jin Kirso and um, Oh, and the other guy, I forget his name, I'm so sorry. But um, yeah, he, he's just an awesome figure. He's so witty and he's so funny, but he's such a big seven foot robot otherwise, right? Now, the reason why I'm so uh, pleased about this is that I actually have another cup topper of similar fashion for BB-8 when uh, Force Awakens came out. So it's really cool to have another cup topper in the shape of K2SO. You can just sort of see the awesome uh, depiction of him with the really cool detailing. Very, very nice figure. A limited articulation. I, the arms do move a little bit, but I don't want to chance it because last time I did, I think I snapped an arm off <laughs> and had to glue it back on. So this is a really awesome uh, display piece for myself. Very similar to BB-8 right here. Uh, a really nice K2SO um, Rogue One Cinema Cup Cup Topper to end off my haul today. Really, really pleased with that one. Look at that. So this is Richard from Richard's Corner signing off for now, and I hope you enjoyed this short little haul from my friends over at Value Village here in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Again, if you haven't already subscribed, please hit like, please hit subscribe, and stay in touch with me so you know what is new and happening here at Richard's Corner. And if you haven't already, please hit that little bell icon as well so that you're instantly notified when something new has been uploaded. Again, all of your likes, your subs, your comments, and, and love and support for this channel continue to drive me forward on this YouTube journey, and I'm... Uh, very privileged and honored to share it with you guys. So thank you so much, my awesome viewers, for checking out my channel today.
So it is Rich from Richard's Corner signing off for now. I'm going to wish you happy hunting and happy collecting, and I hope that all of your finds, thrifty or otherwise, are equally awesome. Please stay tuned for another video, guys, and we will see you next time. Thanks again for visiting Richard's Corner, guys.